The glider is probably one of the most important items you want to get your hands on as quick as possible in Palia. While the item can be unlocked fairly early game, the quest line to get there, as well as the materials required for it, can be pretty confusing to obtain. My name is Foriam and welcome Palians to my glider guide in which I'm going to share everything you need to know so you can start flying in no time. Let's get right to it. You have no idea how much you help out the channel by simply leaving a like and sharing your thoughts. If you have more questions about the game or video suggestions, please don't hesitate to leave them in the comments down below. Cheers. All right, so first you're gonna have to make a little bit of progression with your storyline to unlock some introduction quests. The first one is called Ancient Battery, in which you're gonna have to explore a chamber inside the door. You want to interact with the well in the center of the room, as well as the door at the very end to investigate. This also brings us to solving the riddle. To enter here, you must supply that which grows life. To solve the riddle, you want to equip your watering can and fill this up to open up the mysterious door. At the very end of this room, you will find a ravine which you cannot cross. So now we need to talk with Jima to start the Like a Bird questline, to basically get her hands on a glider so we can cross the ravine. After you've picked up the quest, you want to travel to Bahari Bay, the second zone in Palia. There are two different ways to do this. You can either use the Bahari Bay travel on the eastern part of the map near the Whispering Banks, or you can visit one of the quick travel boards. If you interact with it, you simply want to select Bahari Central Stables to get there as quick as possible. You want to talk to Najuma and ask if she can build a glider for you, because this will give you a follow-up quest for which you're gonna have to gather different types of resources. Three sapwood planks, two fabric, as well as five leather. You're gonna need a load of sapwood planks in Palia, so I recommend you to visit Ashura to unlock the blueprint to process them. Most of the times he can be found around the tavern or fishing a little bit northwest of the town. In his foraging guild store, you can unlock the recipe Basic Sawmill, which produces sapwood planks. If you're feeling lazy, you could also alternatively visit the blacksmith, as right here you can purchase sapwood planks for 4 gold each. The two fabric is probably the most difficult to get your hands on early game, for which I recommend you to either get a level 2 of furniture making or visit the furniture store, which you can find right here. If you talk to Tish, you can open up her store where you can pick up the recipe for the fabric loom, with which you can make both fabric and leather. For the leather, you want to hunt Cernix for their hide, so you can process it in base, while for the fabric, you need to visit the general store in Kilima to get your hands on some cotton seeds, which cost 40 gold each, but this is a good investment for the long term. And I'm getting a friendly whisper right here from John, very much appreciate it. You'll have to first plant the cotton seeds in your base, water them, and wait for them to grow. Afterwards, take the cotton, process it into fabric, which can take a pretty long time. So yeah, once again, if you are feeling lazy today, just visit the furniture store where you can pick up both fabric and leather. Fabric can be pretty expensive though, with a price of 190 each. Leather is a little bit cheaper, 60 each, but long story short, if you decide to purchase all the items for this quest, it's gonna cost you a total of 512 gold. Not that much, especially if you already know about my insane gold farm, which can make you over 15,000 gold per hour, which you can find in the top right of the screen. Anyways, once you've obtained all the resources, you want to get back to Bahari Bay and talk to Najuma, as the reward for this quest will be your glider. Voila, congratulations, now you can start flying like a bird, reach distant places a lot easier, especially little treasure islands which you can find all over Palia. Ladies and gentlemen, a big thanks for watching, be sure to leave a like if you found this video helpful and yeah, if you have more questions or video suggestions, be sure to leave them in the comments down below. Right now though, it is 4am out, I want to wish you an amazing day in Palia, I'll see you in the next one, peace.